Hey guys, um, welcome back to Gaming with Oz. Um, I have received today a box from Limited Run Games. Um, it is the uh, special uh, classic edition of the Bloodstained Curse of the Moon. Uh, so I'm just going to undo this. I'm doing this with my phone, so this might get a little awkward. Hopefully I do not cut myself. Uh, please don't mind, let's see, the cold medicine and the several game controllers and gaming paraphernalia on my very old coffee table. I'm just going to move that away so you can't see the address labels while I cut this open. Alright, split that over. Okay, ooh, oh, ooh, that pretty. Okay, stay open, you stupid box. Okay. Alright, ooh, ooh, oh, oh, this is... This is really nice. Um, so this is the switch box with the sort of classic um, uh, art that make it look more like a, uh, a NES game. Let's see. I actually already own this on digital, but oh, I just I just love this edition. Let's have a look. There's something else in the box. What is this? Um, oh, it's just a little limited run sort of trading card, I guess. They, they do really good additions, so I, I like this, it's it's cool, I'm gonna put this back. Is there anything else in here? No, I don't think so, okay. Anyway, uh, back to this unboxing, which I'm sure is going very well. I'm just gonna put the phone down for a second. Okay, let's come this. Or that. Hang on, I know what I do. I'm just going to prop this up for a second. Well, I'm gonna cut this open. Where's my scissors? Ah. Just trying not to uh, destroy the outer packaging, which is lovely. Okay, so we have this. I'm gonna take the the little outer case off. Hang on. Ooh, okay. So once you take the case off, you can see it's got the um. It, it has no switch logo, so it, it. I think this is just if you want to have it displayed somewhere and you don't want to have it as a switch game, I mean, which is a bit weird. Uh, I will just open this. I really should have set up my DSLR for this. Ooh, okay. Okay, out you come. Okay, so we have the official switch case, which is very nice. All the art. I, I heard this was supposed to be a prequel, but originally just originally, but that became a spin-off. So yeah, we've got that. Um, we have, I believe there's a manual in there, but we'll, we'll have a look in a second. I'm just gonna put this down while I get everything out. Hang on a moment, say. Oh, that's something. That's something else. Um, okay, so that's the. I'm just looking inside the box. Okay, so we have a official soundtrack, which I've been waiting for. Oh, oh, there's quite a lot of tracks on here. Oh wow. Um, I will have to find my uh CD player, which I took out of my gaming laptop to install an extra fan, so I can actually rip this. Um, I've just been listening to the rips on YouTube, which, which has been pretty good. But now I have the official thing, so thank you very much. Um, there is a poster. Which I will try to get open with one hand. I, I think I'm going to try to get this like laminated or something. Because I absolutely love these posters. I don't have enough of them. I'm just going to unfold this. So um, here is the full poster. Which is basically the, the artwork. And that's, that is so cool. I, I really like this. Um, I'll just quickly try to put that down. And I'll sh uh, there is also you if you get games from Limited Run like they'll give you like a little thing to put around your game, uh, which is just a little sleeve, which is pretty cool. Uh, I'm gonna open the box of the game because I believe there is a color manual, which is love, which I love. I'll just put the camera down for a sec. No, just uh, actually set up a proper thing next time I do one of these. Ooh, plastic. Um. So, here is the inside of the game, which is, again, the very lovely artwork. God, I am so freaking pumped for Ritual of the Night. Bloodstained Ritual, yeah, it's not the game. I'm, I'm getting confused, guys. I'm getting confused with the names. Ah! So, here is the manual, which is, I believe, all in colour. Ah! 
I can't get it open with one hand. Oh, I dropped it. Oh no! Um, oh, oh, this is lovely. Um, so you, it gives you the story, which you, you see the little game opening scroll. Um, oh, Zangetsu, big beefy boy. Oh, you get little character pages. Oh, one for Miriam. And then we got Alfred, who... Oh, he looks a little bit more sinister here. Um, then we've got Jebel, Jebel. Yeah, um, that's, that's pretty much it. I, I'm a very big fan of this collector's edition. I, I don't know if, who else got one, but yeah, that's uh, it for me. Like and subscribe. Bye.